Hi. What's up? You good? You good? Are you good? Uh huh. <laughs>and today i am feeling extra extra goofy that's why i am all up in your face but it's not an ugly face it, it is not so it's okay to be all up in your face <laughs> kidding i'm just kidding oh my god what's happening to me and i haven't even taken anything like sugar or alcohol i'm just like this naturally naturally anywho you're welcome to this week's video and if you're new here i'm duko and yes most of the times i am just this jovial and this crazy and this goofy so i really hope that's what you like because if it's not what you like well <laughs> it's going to be pretty 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 awkward for you but let's hope you like awkward this week i am doing the what what is it called the kenyan tag oh my god i just got like i just forgot for a second that i am doing the kenyan tag hold up have you seen my hair people <laughs> Team natural wrapping and it's grown so long yes it's long i have never been this excited about rocking a natural hairstyle <laughs> like today because i used like the most common of products i am telling you it's a nice and lovely um i think it's a sheen cream or something it's supposed to make your hair shine but i use that and coconut oil and water did some uh twist out stroke bantu knots i don't know what i think it's bantu knots I twisted it then put it up in bantu knots and then in the morning I took it out and this is how it looks I am so excited about it anyway I digress what I was telling you is I am doing the Kenyan tag today and that is a tag that had been going around last year and I was not on YouTube then I used to watch it but I was not a youtuber by then so that's what I will be doing so that you can get to know more about me Yes? Oh, my camera is shaking. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, I am too excited today. Anyway, let's get into it right now. I was born in Nairobi, Kenya, uh, in Pumwani Hospital. Everybody knows that hospital. Like, it's, it's, it's a maternity hospital, and that's where I was born, but I was just born there. Growing up, I grew up in Bukambani, Kaskeu. By now, people who watch my videos know that I was... I grew up in Kaskeu, yeah. So, but I was born in Pumwani Hospital, Nairobi, Kenya. And then I grew up in Makueni County, Kaskeu. Yes, Kaskeu Village. Kaskeu Market. Village. <laughs> yeah, that. So I am just a village girl. I am your ordinary village girl. My mom comes from Makueni, Kaskeu, that's where I grew up. And my dad comes from Machakos County, somewhere called Kibauni. Kibauni, it's in Wamunyu, somewhere in Machakos. Yeah, so they are, they are both Kambas. One comes from Machakos County and the other one comes from Makueni County. But right now I live in Nairobi, Nairobi, Kenya. Duko. And that's the name I go by because it's unique and it's fancy. Well, it's not so unique when you go to Ukamani. Everybody there is called Nduko. But if you're, let's say here, the YouTube society and <laughs> the social media society, they're not that many like, yeah. So I like the name Nduko. That's my second name. That's my Kenyan name. Nduko Ndiani. Ndiani is my dad. So yeah, Nduko Ndiani. Duh, duh, I have grown up in Ukambani, so I know Kikamba like perfectly. I am fluent in Kikamba and also Swahili. I know Kiswahili and that's pretty much the languages I communicate in most of the times because when I'm with my family, it's Kikamba and when I'm with my friends, it's Swahili or English. So yes, Kikamba and Kiswahili. Right now, I am in Kenya, right now. 
I live in Kenya. There are many, 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 many. Number one, Nameless, Patricia Kihoro, uh, This is S, Wahoo, Amani, um, Nyashinsky, there are so many. Mutoni Njoba, um, who else, who else, who else, who else, Nancy Moy. I'm just talking about the people that I watch on YouTube or songs that I like. Fee, Edith Kimani, Lilian Muli, uh, Muhammad Ali, Hussein Muhammad, <laughs> Jonalan Namu. Yeah, those, those are pretty much most of the celebrities I know, but there are more. Trust me, it's only that right now I can't remember them, but there are way more. Baby, Baby by Nyashinsky. Oh my god, that song. It's so nice. And yeah, I love it. That's my favorite Kenyan song as of now. And I also love Nyashinsky's songs and Sauti Soul's songs and Le ba the bands. What's, what's the band? Is, is it the band? The band? I don't know. When you remember. Kelly 2, Wakwanye. Uh uh, Wakwanye. Uh uh. Has some. Some kamba, some kamba in it. That's why I remember that band, but I don't know the name. <laughs> I don't know the name. Some of my favorite bands, Salty Soul and that band. I think it's the band or the band. I'm not sure. That has to be. I don't like Ugali, so it's definitely not Ugali. My favorite Kenyan food has to be chapati. Yeah, chapati and dengu. <laughs> wow, such combination. Yes, chapati and dengu or mudokoi. I love mudokoi. Yes, those two. And I haven't eaten mudokoi in such a long time. That painting is Kenyan. I bought it from Hilton Arcade. Yo. So that's something I own that's Kenyan. And I bought it like three years ago when I was moving out after campus. When I was moving out to my own place after campus. So, Kenyan, we're rapping. We're rapping. I love African art. Cat calling. Cat calling. I hate cat calling. Yani, especially these condas or makanga when you're, when you're at the stage. And you're just minding your own business or just people standing idlers standing somewhere and they're just calling out like madam sasa auntie mambo sijini or worse when they just say inappropriate things like most of the times people are like hey maziwa mtoto iko sawa how, how do people find it okay to just say something like that it's so inappropriate it's inappropriate um or when they say when he says yangu. Okay, sometimes it's so demeaning and sometimes it goes to the point of they grab your hand and you cannot do anything because most of them are are way stronger. So they can grab oh there's something in my eye. Most of them are way stronger than I am or than most chicks are. So they can grab your hand and then there's nothing actually they are telling you. Ati madam ukosawa. At the city and the home or something. I don't know. I just don't like the cat calling, especially in Nairobi. It's terrible. It's so demeaning. And sometimes I feel so bad because there's nothing you can do about it. I am not strong. I do not know martial arts. I do not know how to fight back. And I do not like talking back. But sometimes I just talk back. But it's terrible. It's really terrible. That's my least favorite thing about Kenya. Let let me not let me not continue. Corruption is terrible. Corruption. Right now, Kenya is broke, apparently. And you don't understand how a, a country goes broke when people are still um, being taxed. And there's enough money. According to the budget, there was enough money. But somehow, the country goes broke. But then, there's so many cases of corruption. I don't know a bridge that... A small bridge that's been built for, like, 20 million... Um, 
pens that have been bought for 15 million like smallest of things and it's corruption that's one thing i'd like to change about kenya those are the questions that i had i got this challenge from this is s no the my two cents which has this is s and susan lucky Wong. all in all i love kenya i love my people and i love living in kenya it's it's so nice except the traffic and what yeah the traffic except that but i love being kenyan because look at all this glow all this kenyan glow why would you not love being kenyan why would i not love being kenyan <laughs> Aki, i'm talking too much what's wrong with me <laughs> oh god anyway guys that's that's it um I have enjoyed making this video you can all take if you have a youtube channel you can take up and maybe do a kenyan tag like i have and that way your subscribers can get to know a little bit more about you yeah so that's pretty much it and i think i will see you in my next video please 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 don't forget to subscribe if you haven't thank you guys for watching and please don't forget to like subscribe and comment have a great week and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.